23 points on first and second nine respectively, emerging the overall winner of the inaugural Tatu Classic Golf Tournament that was held at Nyeri Golf Club. The tournament, organized by Tatu Emp Empowerment Initiative Group, comprised of golfers, well-wishers and investors from Tatu constituency in Nyeri. Gaido Nyukafi won the men winner category, while Jacinta Mwangi topped the ladies. Oneri Tunyaga and Tugi Kigwa uh, led in the juniors category. The event attracted more than 120 players with an aim of supporting the boy child through the empowerment programs, through the TVET training, talent tapping and rehabilitation of those affected by drugs and substance abuse. Is here. We are talking of the boy child, empowerment of the boy child. We have realized that uh, so many things are being done to the boy child, but actually nothing much is happening. Uh, there is fight against alcoholism and substance abuse, but still after that, there's nothing else happening. So we brought up all those uh, people, so that at least after this tournament, we tell them the plan that we have that is empowering um, the boy child, that is through uh, education through sports and through industries that we want at least this year to do a, prog a program in Tetu. Ensuring that our boy child uh, is not affected by the drugs and substance abuse. Those that are affected, our plan is to take them through rehabilitation. We know the county government of Nyeri has built a rehabilitation center in Tetu, Ihororo. And so our boy child, we are going to take them through the rehabilitation. Uh, after that, we take them through the TVET training. They take up a course, and after the course, our plan is also to ensure that for sustainability, we uh, promote them with the tools. Whichever course they'll take up, we promote them with the tools uh, for startup. They to classic golf, a golf with a purpose, so that we can empower the boy child in Tetu. And Tetu Empowerment Initiative is about three things, empowerment through education, empowerment through skills, empowerment also through cottage industries.